Hey there, horror fans. Welcome back to Through the Woods. We have just escaped the first troll. Um, and we finally acknowledge the fact that there was a troll. And the, the big broken moon, which I spotted a while ago. I'm assuming that that could be possibly something to do with Ragnarok. Because isn't it like a giant wolf swallows the moon? Or something? Uh, I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to carry on. I'm hoping he'll give us a bit of a breather for a minute. Because, um... <sighs> That first troll was terrifying. Ah, it started back to being lovely. Although I still think there's some kind of water troll or something out there ready to kill us. I'm hoping I can find a save mark soon because I haven't actually found one in a while. And if I die, I'm going to have to go all the way back and do that troll thing again. Oh, lights. Although I'm not always assuming that lights are a good thing in this game now because the last lights we went to was a troll cave. I, for a moment I've completely- oh house, yay! I completely forgot about the fact that I had a son who was missing. <laughs> Screw the sun, the trolls, I'm off, bye. Ooh, scary music Stein. So I'm assuming there was a village here. Um, whether it's like past and it's gone or- oh, more readables. Okay. Knocking. Tis said knocking lurks in the waters near here. Can't say I've been one for such fanciful stories for yestive. Saw a small grassy hillock resting in the water. The lake's usually smooth as glass, so I rubbed my eyes and looked again, and by the gods, I swear I saw a pair of eyes staring out at me through the tangle. I blinked, but the hillock was gone with a ripple. I shuddered and bent back to me work, but then there came a blubbering in the waters right near the shore, and a clump of weedy tendrils dripping mud came searching from the lake. I sprinted away to my cabin, cabin, gibbering, thinking what kind of ghastly creature might follow those weedy fingers. Tis said you can rid yourself of a knocken if you speak its name. The thought that something could give a creature like that a name is near enough to drive you mad. Oh! I assume that's the thing I heard splishing about then. Can you stop turning my light off, please, when I'm attempting to get spooked? Oh! I assume that will be the knockin' then. I'm probably going to have to be involved with that at some point in the future. I'm not looking forward to that at all. This game is legitimately terrifying. <sighs> I always thought it'd be nice if someone could do a game, and you know, I'm quite happy to get involved in this, um, do a game based on English folklore. Because we kind of have a great love of, uh, should I go down? Nah, uh, I don't think that's just branches, but let's have a look. Um, I don't really want to die, that's the thing. I don't mind like normally running off into my death like funsies, but I don't really want to die because then I don't, I haven't hit a save marker in a while. Oh, Jesus. Um, and if I die, then I'm gonna have to go back and do the troll again. There's another reflector. Where? Espen, you're alive. What? Don't be scared, little man. I'm coming. Where? Oh, if I gotta go across the cray scary bridge. Run! Oh, it's there. Ah. Run! Get off the bridge, get off the bridge, get off the bridge. Um, yeah, I haven't hit a save marker in a while, so if I die, I'm gonna have to go back, and I don't want to. Oh, I did not like that. I am not brave. Um, anyway, yeah, we, we, we love kind of other folklore, you know? There's... everything seems to have pervaded... Oh, what's that noise? Um, you know, like Norse, we love Norse mythology, Greek mythology, um, even like Irish and Scottish seems to get a much better kind of following than than English. And I'm sure we've, we've probably got some great folklore things, you know? Some good old myths and, uh, well, that's a nice stick. And stories that would make a great... Oh, is this where he was whittling? Is this where the knockin's gonna get me? 
You know, so that'd be kind of cool if we could do a... a... Oh, I'm so scared. What's that? Oh my god, what's that? Thyskan Niflung. Miss children, left out by the lake, away from town, away from Eric's reach, in a desperate hope that something else could take care for it. Claw marks and hair can be found inside, most likely taken by Tussler to live underground with the other subterranean whites. Oh, I picked that up. For reasons. I'm getting away from the water, because it's scary. Um. Yeah, so that would be kind of cool. We must have some nice creepy stories to uh, to go through. I mean, you know, UK myths in general and folk... <gasps> oh, thank God. <sighs> oh, okay, now, okay, I've hit a, um, a, a save point, so I can go back and explore a little bit more. I was a bit hesitant to explore because I didn't want to die, and then I'd have to go back. So now I've done it, let's go and, uh, let's go poke stuff. Can I see the knocking again? Why is the water red? Are you a knocking? Knock on effect? <laughs> nope. Okay. Um. Windy. Ag. Um. Yeah. So I reckon we can. Yeah, you, know, you could make a pretty a pretty scary kind of British folklore game we've got to have some good stuff and we've got like changelings I'm pretty sure that's UK I say UK because I'm not sure which ones are English which ones are Scottish which ones are Irish which ones are Welsh because um, there's the changeling one which is the idea that your child is replaced by a fairy child and people used to believe that if their child suddenly looked different or acted different, they have been replaced by a changeling. Um, what else did we have? Wasn't there like a family called Sawney? Who were, I, I believe that is folklore. Um, they were cannibals. And apparently they ate lots and lots of people. And were very inbred. Um, Sawney Bean. I think were their name. Um You stab me, you hoary bitch. What's going on? Wow, she proper stabbed him. Whoa. What was that? Oh, there's some East Enders shriek going on there. Oh, here we go. Yep, yeah, let's go get killed by a knocking. lovely but uneventful jumping all over the shop yeah, let's go up here is it this house am I gonna find a corpses yeah corpses uh, I don't see any corpses dear diary today I stabbed my husband he was a coward so I deaded him Uh, nothing to to do to see nothing 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 stop making that noise love you keep scaring me 
Oh, 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 oh. Pick up. Pick up. Where is it? Brothers, I found, I found a wedge. I'm assuming this is, this is a, uh, a Norse story. Um... For a split second I did read wedgie rather than wedge, but there we go. Oh, I thought that was a hand. It's a tray. Okay, so... Were they sacrificing children then? Is that what I found down by the water? Like, if they give certain children, like maybe the weak and the sick, to old Eric, then it spares the other children. I don't know. I'm just guessing at this point. How did I get up there? Can I get in there? Hello? Hello? Oh, yeah. That's not creepy. Aha. Cool. I'll be waiting. Habard ne'er returned from his hunting this eve. That cursed troll took him. I know it. Oh, Habard. Always sneaking into the horrid creature's hole to pick up bones and still rotted furs he was. Troll's too slow and stupid to catch me, he often says. But rare is the day he returns so late. And now I sit here hungry and lonesome and wonder from whence my next meal will come. Ye fooled, Habard. Yeah, I think he was the dude. Uh, oh, Christ. I think he was the dude that got munched. Oh, I like the bed with the little horsey things on. That's cool. Yeah, I think Harbard is uh, troll poop now, I'm afraid, my love. Okay, so back down and then out. Oh, oh no, we've got this house to go into first. Ugh. Oh, this must be the house. This must be the house where she uh, murderised her husband. To Ingrid. Ingrid, my darling, I've done something terrible and have shamed ye and myself. I wanted to fight for ye and make ye safe. I know this was a foolish notion and your father saw it true. Set out to try and stop old Eric afore he could come to claim ye. But Yada meant to stop me. I cut him. I cut his neck and he bled out. I can't wait here for Eric to take ye. I can't. I know I'll never earn forgiveness from ye or the gods, but I'm leaving. Don't be scared, my sweet girl, and don't ye search for me. Mayhaps ere long we'll raise the sails and join ye father upon the lovely ocean once more. With love, ye mother. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that was the mother. Um... Oh, okay. So their child was going to be taken by. They were here. I heard them. This paper is so old. Yeah, and he's kind of fleshy gooeyness. Ah, okay. So I'm assuming then Eric isn't the troll because they would be saying old Eric the troll when they were talking about the troll earlier. So I'm assuming old Eric is something different. Like a evil Santa. Cool, cool, cool. So far we haven't been knocked by the knocking. I'm going to take that as a bonus. She says before she gets eaten by him. Is that rain or fire? Oh, music's getting ominous. Oh, am I going to get knocked by the knocking now? Or is that just a plane going overhead? Oh, 
Oh god. Oh my god, my dog just barked and scared the living snot out of me. Oh god, what's that? What was that? the knock on the knock on effect i'm off see ya oh oh god this game is terrifying like legitimately scary oh it's just it's everything's like it's sound if you love sound design you'll like this game because you can just hear things in the back and the snarls and twitches and rustling and and you don't know if it's just sound? Because I assume this is the wilderness so there'll be like bunny rabbits and stuff. Oh! Okay, I just... ninja through that pet. Okay. Okay, this seems a bit lighter. Wait. Can I hear the foot foot stepping steppins of a big old troll? I hope not. This is a bit lighter here. I can kind of cope without the torch. What was that? Okay, you know what? I'm going to leave this here because I have a feeling this is going to be another, uh, oh, another scary bit. So I want to make sure that I've got my wits about me for it. Um, I'm keeping these episodes quite short. Because um, there is a lot of walking around and stuff, and I don't want <laughs> I don't want them to be long episodes of me just running around scared. So um, yeah, join me in the next one. We're going to find out what the hell that noise is. Um, oh god, that's so scary. Um, and as always, stay safe out there. Bye. <laughs>